Hello everyone. Today we are going to explain how to configure PC based Microtik router in virtual box so that you should know you should download virtual box and install it right so where we can download virtual box if you want to download virtual box you should go to virtual box website right virtual box download the then go to the link then there is an option is windows host just click it here it will start downloading right very good then install it okay so we already uh, install it just next next finish after that download microtik iso from microtik website as we are going to install pc based microtik we should download microtik iso how to download it you should go to the microtik.com then you should go to the software and there is a several version like router os version 7 and router os version 6 you can download cdms x86 under the cdms just click here it will start downloading we also download this iso file our download already done our download already done okay very good now the two steps all already done the two step already done create virtual machine in virtual box okay open the virtual box then new just type microtik next 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 finish simply the virtual machines also created done virtual machine already created now we need to install the iso inside the virtual box there should be another step step for install microtik iso in virtual pc The, it will be step 4 and it will be step 5 and it will be step 6 ok you should just go to the setting then system select the optical drive priority first then go to the storage there is an option is selecting cd just go to the disk file and select microtik iso here then click ok now start it's installing there is a several option for select all feature just press a then for installing press i okay yes enter to reboot just press enter it will be reboot but we should power of the pc because we need to change the boot priority you should go to the uh, system and there is a hard disk hard disk should be priority high okay then again start
the default username is admin press enter there is no password yes enter press enter enter new password okay you should set the password okay i am putting just a 1 2 3 4 5 6 1 2 3 4 5 6 very good the password is set so that now router was installed in virtual pc okay the step is done this step is also done okay configure network setting we need to configure network setting for access the router from winbox right this is the virtual router right and if you want to connect the router using winbox we should create a lan from host to virtual router so first of all you should disable the uh, we should turn off the router how to turn off system to shut down yes okay now we need to install one network interface card microsoft loopback network card how to do it you should go to the device manager then select network and action to add legacy hardware right go to the next 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 there should be network adapter then just select microsoft and sh should be there is a adapter is loopback yes microsoft came just loopback adapter select next finish okay very good now we need change some setting of virtual pc go to the setting then there is a network select breeze and select microsoft cam test loopback adapter because we are going to learn using loopback adapter just select then click ok very good then start in the meantime we can assign on ip this lan card you should go to the lan card there is ip version 4 like we are giving the ip address 192.168.88 to very good let's log in the router okay now as an ip address right we provide one ip address in the host LAN card host pieces LAN card now we are going to same block IP address here IP address add address 192.168.88.1 slash 24 interface ether1 disable equal to no just press enter okay our LAN configuration also done. Now we are trying to connect the router using Winbox software. open the winbox then and now you can see there is a one router just click and the password is one two three four five six connect yes 
now we can able to successfully connect the micro tick router using Oenbox. Thank you for watching. Best of luck.